Yeah, interesting interview. Senator, or sorry, State Representative John Lovick has quite the perspective. He not only is the longest serving black legislator in the state, he also served in law enforcement for decades. You know, I have to tell you this, Drew, uh, and you probably, <laughs> really sorry, but you probably would do better interviewing somebody else because it's very, very emotional for me. I grew up in the South. I was in law enforcement. I absolutely love the profession. But I also know that it's so unfortunate that we it had to take sacrificing the life of a man to really bring some truth and some justice to where we are, where we need to be. First elected to Olympia in 1999, Representative John Lovick was at the time the only black state representative. He's proud to be one of nine black legislators today. Lovick says the murder of George Floyd in Minnesota helped steer lawmakers in Washington state. Bills banning the use of chokeholds and neck restraints, restricting when police can chase someone, and limiting the use of tear gas are all proposals likely to become state law soon. We spent a lot of time this summer making phone calls around the country, trying to do things that we could do to try and, like I've said before, reimagine policing. Try and, what can we do to bring the community together? What can we do to make sure that those who do not trust the system will trust it now? And maybe we are going to get there with some of the legislation we're working on and with this verdict. Following today's verdict, Governor Jay Inslee released a statement. Part of it read, quote, weary families in so many communities traumatized from images of brutality against black and brown and feeling no power to stop it can take heart today that justice was served in this instance. Yet there is still much work to do. The governor is expected to sign a number of police accountability bills into law. Here we are in the final days of this year's legislative session. Some of those details are being ironed out as we speak. Live in Olympia, Drew Mickelson, King 5 News.